We are talking about Moringa, okay? One of the biggest new supplements to hit the market in a while and probably one of the coolest and one of my favorites. So this is Moringa 101. So what is Moringa? Well, in 2008, the National Institute for Health called this the plant of the year. But it's been around a lot longer than that. You see, the World Health Organization has been using Moringa for over 40 years to combat malnutrition, okay? And we're going to show you exactly why it's used to combat malnutrition. So what is it? Well, Moringa, in all actuality, is a tree. It's a very fast-growing, leafy green tree producing leaves, pods, and flowers. Okay. Now, there's actually 12 different types of Moringa out there. But the one that people refer to most when you hear the word Moringa is Moringa oleifera. So for all intents and purposes, what we're talking about today is Moringa oleifera. Now, there are many uses of this tree, okay? This tree can grow in very sandy and very bad soil, okay? So the tree itself is great because it can grow where a lot of other trees can't. And then over time, as the plant matter around it decomposes, it will actually make the soil around it more fertile. So that's great. Now, the tree also produces pods okay and inside those pods are seeds okay if you squish those seeds you get oil out of it now that oil can be used for cooking oil it can be used on the skin for moisturizing and it can be used to treat minor cuts and scrapes okay but that's not all after you squeeze the seeds out you can take those seeds and purify water with it put them in water stir it around it will suck out all the impurities okay now, here's the part where most people use the tree for, the leaves themselves, okay? You take the leaves, you cut them off, dry them like tobacco, okay? And then mill them into a fine powder, and you get an extremely, extremely powerful nutritional supplement. People also take the leaves and the flowers and brew that into a tea, okay? So it can be used for supplementation in that way as well. And then the bark and root are also used as medicine in traditional cultures. So as you can see, the tree is extremely, extremely giving, okay? It's one of those trees that, you know, you can really help out a community with if you know how to properly use it. Let's talk about some of the benefits, okay? And when we talk about the benefits, we're of course talking about the leaves, okay? That's where most of the nutritional supplementation comes from. So the leaves themselves, when they're dried and milled into that powder. Now, Moringa is extremely nutrient dense. Gram for gram, Moringa leaf powder has seven times more vitamin C than an orange. It has four times more vitamin A than carrots. It has four times more calcium than milk. And it has three times more potassium than bananas. It also has three times more iron than spinach. And three times more vitamin E than almonds. And it also has two times the protein of yogurt, which is extremely cool because that's very rare that you find in a leafy green plant. So as you can see, all these things that we've come to know as extremely dense in uh, one vitamin um, or a mineral, Moringa actually blows them all out of the water and it's one leaf. So it's very, very cool. Now, the more and more benefits of Moringa are coming up every day, okay, but we do know that it's extremely good for detoxification. Think about how that mashed up seed purifies water. The leaves do the same thing in your body, okay? They purify it of those impurities, okay? So it's extremely detoxifying. The leaves also contain all the essential amino acids, so it's great for building muscle. It's great for your body and very easily digestible. Um, the fact that it's a leafy green protein source is phenomenal. These are very hard to find. Okay, so if you can find a good quality plant-based green protein source, that's phenomenal because it's also alkalizing. Okay, green plants are extremely alkalizing and obviously alkalizing is good because our bodies become acidic over time, but they operate much better when they're alkaline. They're also now um, proving how many antioxidants this plant has, which also makes it great for anti-aging. So as you can see, the leaves in this powder, there's more and more things coming out every day that Moringa supports.